Welcome to Now, I'm your host, Curtis Parody, bringing you the news happening in the world right now. So happy Wednesday, I hope you're all doing amazing, or at least a bit better than the guy in the first story of the day. I thought, hey, there's no better way to start off a Wednesday than watching two, well, let's say, intelligent people boating together. Yep, skill-a-doo. Okay, great way to start off the video there. I've never heard anyone say that while boating, but of course, you know, whatever goes here. Looking at the situation they're in, I would assume that the one boat they're pulling ran out of gas or something because, well, it's not often you see one boat pulling another. He needs a beer, throw him a beer. Wait, what? He needs a beer? Okay, great, but don't frickin' throw, wait, don't do it. Oh, you did it. Oh! Wow, just freaking wow. You had to throw the beer at the guy. Good job, Sonny Jim. Like, how are you gonna even explain that to someone when, like, they ask? Yeah, so, like, we's having a great old time. Bob's pulling my boat here because, well, I done dare forgot to put that gasoline in it. But that's all right, Bob's got himself a rope and he be pulling me. Then I thought, well, you know, I should pay Bob back for all this help he's given me. So I'm gonna throw a beer at him. Then, shit, the beer be sailing out of my hand and struck Bob right in the old noggin. Then he fell in the water and I was like, shit. <laughs> Yeah, I think that's how they'd explain it. Remember the boating and drinking thing? It's a bad combination, especially when drinking on its own for someone with the mental capacity, as the guys in this video, is well a danger to public safety as it is. From Sonny Jim and his friend Bob, let's talk about some awesome movie news that came out today. New images and concept art was released today for the Marvel Phase 2 films. Now, if you don't know what Phase 2 films are, then don't fret because I didn't even know what they were either until I stumbled upon this story. Ever since the first Iron Man movies, Marvel has been producing the Phase 1 films. These films are basically just to establish a character before they all got brought together over the summer for the Avengers movie. That of course ends Phase 1. Phase 2 starts this summer with the Iron Man 3 movie. All of the Phase 2 movies will fall in the time frame after the events that happened in New York City in the Avengers film. New photos show off the production of the new Thor movie and concept art for the upcoming Captain America movie called The Winter soldier. And hey, there's even a sneak peek into another interesting Marvel character that could soon be making an appearance in the films, Rocket Raccoon. You can see in this early artist rendering the interesting amount of detail that's going into the character. Though, keep in mind, this is just an early artist render. Until we see him in film, it's hard to know how this character will really be presented. Overall, the second phase of the Marvel world looks to be coming together quite well, with the first of these films, Iron Man 3, to be coming out on May 3rd of this year. The second, Thor The Dark World, will be released on November 8th of this year as well. Then the new Captain America movie will come out on April 4th of 2014. And something I've never really heard of before, but I'm sure many big Marvel fans have, Guardians of the Galaxy is coming to the big screen on August 1st of 2014. Then Phase 2 will wrap up with the Avengers 2 film, which will hopefully land in theaters on May 1st of 2015. But boom, that's not it. Because while well, Phase 3 will kick off with a smaller superhero than the others, Ant-Man will be making his big screen debut on November 6th of 2015. So the team behind the Marvel films has quite a lot of work ahead of them. But hey, if you're a Marvel fan like myself, look out! Because there are plenty more movies coming out with your favorite stars in them in the future. If you want, you can check out an awesome video of this entire thing. Link to it in the description below, like always. From the big screen to the small screen, it looks like Jay Leno is once again leaving his late night show. Yes, but this time he's pretty sure it's for good unlike in 2009. Jay will end his show on TV in 2014 when his contract is up. This will allow late night host Jimmy Fallon to take his place. It's interesting to see this all happening because, well, it was only a few years ago that he stepped down to let Conan O'Brien take his place, which then resulted in Jay getting bad ratings on his new show in a new time slot, so NBC brought him back to The Tonight Show and kicked Conan to the curb. Surprisingly, this didn't go over well with Conan, who then went to TBS and started his own show, which, surprise, surprise, is actually doing pretty well. I think it'll be interesting to see how this whole transition takes place. Will Jay actually leave the show, or is he gonna have like a repeat of what happened in 2009? And one last thing I wanted to throw in here today, if you own one of these, well, wish it a happy 40th birthday. Well, the iPhone itself isn't 40 years old today, but the cell phone as a class of device is. 40 years ago, Motorola engineer Marty Cooper placed the first public call from a cell phone in Midtown Manhattan. The funny thing about this is that Marty called his rival at the Bell Labs saying, Joel, this is Marty. I'm calling you from a cell phone, a real handheld portable cell phone. The phone used during this was the Motorola Dynatech 8000X, which weighed a staggering 2.5 pounds, 
which is a far cry from the average four ounces of a cell phone nowadays. Okay, jumping back to the second story of the day, I wanna know, are you looking forward to the new Marvel films that will be coming out in the future? Yes or no? And what superheroes would you like to see in the next Marvel movie? Tell me in the comments section below, or of course you can always let me know on my Facebook page, through Twitter, or on Google+. Links to all that and the other topics I talked about in today's episode in the description below, along with the always amazing subscribe button. So until next time, I'm Curtis Parody, and that's what's happening now. Hey everyone, I hope you enjoyed this video. You can of course check out more videos that I create by clicking on them below. Check out now for the latest news happening in the world right now, Paradise Gaming for some fun gameplay videos, or of course my personal vlog channel to see what I'm doing outside of my studio. Also, if you're interested in supporting the show and getting some new clothes for yourself, just like this shirt, you can pick up this one if you want, check out the store at thecurtisparadystore.ca. Bye everyone.